Anzac Day Parade by Glenda Kane, illustrated by Lisa Allen. There he stood on the sun-parched hill, a straggler from the 18th Battalion, a chest load of medals, a leg full of shrapnel. That's what he got for his valiance. So many years since he saw the battle, when 93 mates got blown away by cracking mortar and machine gun rattle, now names on a plaque at the RSA. Fear in their hearts, guns in their hands, the men stood shoulder to shoulder. One by one in that foreign land, they became a fallen soldier. Did you shoot them dead? asked the bright-eyed boy. Did it feel real cool to kill? With a voice bereft of joy, he sighed. No son, it was no thrill. The boy thought that was that, until the old man spoke some more. His eyes downcast to the grass on the hill, he said, what a dirty war. My mate, he said, as church bells pealed. Hugh Ward, now who'd have thought it? Standing there in a Cretan field, old Huey boy, he bought it. Age won't weary him, he said, but boy, it's wearied me. He looked out over the young one's head, and the past was all he could see. Now he shuffled off towards the RSA for a glass to drown his sorrows, and to toast the boys who've had their day, and for whom there are no tomorrows. Let these panels never be filled. At the going down of the sun and in the morning, we will remember them.